How to Run a PowerShell Script in Jenkins Pipeline. Here's today's starting point. I have a Jenkins LTS controller version 2.346.1. Attached to this controller, I have a Linux-based agent that has PowerShell installed on it. Down in the description of this video is a link to a sample repository that we're going to be using. Let's go ahead and take a look at that sample repository. You can see here that we have a Jenkins file and we have a hello.ps1. Let's first take a look at hello.ps1, and you can see that we're just echoing out hello world. Let's take a look at our Jenkins file, and our Jenkins file has two stages. The first stage, we're just going to echo out the version of PowerShell that we have installed. And then secondly, we're going to use PowerShell to run hello.ps1. Let's go ahead and set up the job. But before we do that, let's go ahead and copy our URL. And let's go over here to our controller, click on New Item. Let's type PowerShell. We'll click on Pipeline and click OK. We'll change Pipeline Script to Pipeline Script from SCM. We'll change our SCM to Get. We'll paste in our URL. We'll change our branch specifier to Main. And lastly, we'll verify that the script path is Jenkins file. Let's go ahead and click on Save, and now click on Build Now. If we take a look at the output of build number one, what we'll see is that we have PowerShell 7.2.5, and when the hello.ps1 file is run, we get Hello World. If you have any questions or comments, you can reach out to us on Twitter, at CloudBees. If this video was helpful to you, give us a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to CloudBees TV yet, why not? Take a moment, click on that subscribe button, and then ring that bell, and you'll be notified anytime there's new content available on CloudBees TV. Thanks for watching, and we will see you in the next video.